Netflix said it lost 970,000 subscribers last quarter, which is actually good news considering that the world's largest streaming service shocked Wall Street in April when it said it expected to lose 2 million. Netflix not only avoided that worst-case scenario, but on Tuesday also predicted it would return to customer growth this quarter. As a result, Netflix shares, which have fallen roughly 67 percent due to customer growth concerns, rose in after-hours trading. Few people get my clients' attention the way you have. After years of red-hot growth, the company's fortunes changed as rivals including Disney, Warner Brothers Discovery, and Apple invested heavily in their own streaming services. In a letter to shareholders on Tuesday, Netflix attributed its slowdown to a variety of factors including password sharing, competition, and a sluggish economy. It said it plans to crack down on password sharing and will also launch a less expensive ad-supported option next year as a way to lure more subscribers. Netflix is also looking to build on the success of mega-hit Stranger Things, which has inspired merchandise, and now a spin-off series and a stage play are in the works. Netflix said it's planning to give at least a dozen series and films the Stranger Things treatment.